right, next step is red guard. Here it is the next day. If anybody's wondering if red guard actually really works, check this out. You can't even see the seam line of where my cement board was, my hardy backer. That's how thick this stuff went on. Kind of like rubber. Like here's a piece, you can see it's very flexible. So now when the water goes into the grout line, it stops at this red barrier. I just used the regular premix stuff for this one because it's going over sheetrock. That's the one piece of sheetrock that I left on the back for it. I got some granite cut here. And what I did was I just cut out a six by six piece. I have no seam, but I cut it like that. I'm setting up my granite the way I want it. And it's just gonna go just the way you see it. Okay, so now I'm gonna cut out my tile for my toilet plans. Real easy way to do it is lay your tile in place. Okay, make sure it's lined up where you're gonna have it. 
mark right here. So this is the edge of this one here. And then do your best to mark it out. It's a little bigger, it's okay. The toilet will cover it. And then I found out that my wet saw, the old lathe, is exactly the same size as that. <laughs> so what I'll do, use that as a template. I'll eyeball it right there. And then I'll just trace. over it all right and then we'll cut that out it's going to be a little bit hard because you can see how skinny this is so if this breaks off from here you probably could just do a cut right here because that is going to be covered up by the toilet the inner piece notches like that and when you roll them a second time usually they'll break sorry my OCD is getting to me <laughs> that's pretty much it doesn't have to be perfect all right let's test fit this try boom all right for this half moon cut here you can see I read a bunch of ridges in it just take a little hammer just give it a little tap all right and if that if you want to make it prettier you can run it in the machine again So how am I getting this to go straight? What I did was I put the laser level right here on my first tile and I ran it all the way down. Okay. And then after I, I got it straight because a laser level can go this way or that way and still be straight. I made sure that the tile was uh, even on that side. And then I put a tile over here. Okay, and then you measure from the wall. This wall's a little out of whack from that one, so you can't really measure the wall and, and expect that to be straight either. But then you gotta go over to this wall, and this wall's wonky too, because this was two different separate rooms, so the plaster is completely off. But then I did the laser level over here, and it, can you turn the light on? Wait, Alexa. See, now this laser is perfectly straight all the way across. So I'm straight on the tile here, straight over there, but anyways, that's that's the only way I could think of to get this straight because the walls, I can't go by the walls. I just gonna have to go by the tile itself to be straight with the, uh, where it is with the shower, with the granite over there. So I'm just lining up my granite all the way around and then just working off that granite coming this way and making sure it's straight at the same time. Because if you're off by a sixteenth of an inch, by the time it gets over here, it's a quarter or a half inch off. All right, this is what we got done tonight. I mixed up the thin set a little bit too watery, so when I first started, it was a it was a hassle. It was a I had a lot of trouble because it kept on oozing through the crack, and then about halfway through, it dried out a little bit more, and it was a little bit easier because it wasn't oozing through my grout line so much. So try not to uh, mix your thin set too watery, but it does give you a lot more time to, uh, you know set your tile it doesn't dry as fast all right i'm back from home depot i was up all night working on this tile and then i ran out of the clips the leveling clips so i had to go back to home depot they, luckily they opened at six in the morning it was like 5 30 when i ran out <laughs>
starting here is first cut. All the way around. All of these black, gray are cuts. I'll cut that one later after I finish plumbing the vanity in.